In case you didn't know, this magical place is a part of South America, located mostly in the Southern Hemisphere. Brazil is a vibrant and exciting country. Spanning a huge area in five different time zones, it's an eclectic mixture of people, geography, culture, and landscapes. And that's only the beginning. You should see what's been turning up there. 15 Mysterious Things Discovered in Brazil Six-Fingered Family You know it's in the genes when many people from the same family were born with six fingers. They're putting the extra fingers to good use. The family of football and music lovers can take their hobbies to a higher level thanks to their unique genetic anomaly on each hand. Believe it or not, this makes it easier for the family members to strum guitars, play the piano, and even make a better goalkeeper in soccer. Out of 26 members of the family, 14 have the extra digit on each hand. The goalkeeper of the family loves his advantage in sports but says it's difficult to find gloves. He typically has to buy two sets and stitch a sixth finger on them. While it works for the time being, he's looking for a more permanent solution. The family is proud of their unique family trait and none have squandered utilizing it. The piano teacher responsible for instructing an eight-year-old says he wishes we had six fingers. Continuing practicing with an entire functioning extra finger would allow much more control over the instrument. Fasten your seatbelts because it's time for today's sweet topic. They're the most ferocious fish in the world, former U.S. President Theodore Roosevelt wrote on piranhas. They'll rend and devour alive any wounded man or beast. Mean doesn't begin to describe them. Imagine spearfishing in an underwater cage and a giant piranha like this comes swimming up to you. Most of the 17 species in South American waters are beautiful fish, but not so the black piranha. The biggest of its clan, this purplish flesh eater looks like the embodiment of pure evil, with nightmarish eyes and a jutting jaw lined with razor-edged teeth. In a 2012 study, researchers found that black piranha, the largest of modern species with a maximum force of 72 pounds, that's three times their own body weight. Imagine the kind of damage this fish could do without a cage in its way. Sorry to say, but the fishing spear won't protect you much. You might have to find another way to escape this beast. So, what's the plan then? Comment below with the hashtag sweet topic. The Blue Lake Cave Experts believe that no human had ever set foot in this cave until 1924, when it was first discovered by one of the native Tarina tribesmen who, as far as it's known, had not known of the cave's existence previously. The Mystic Blue Cave is part of one of the largest flooded cavities on Earth, making it all the rarer. Dubbed the Gruta do Lago Azul, or Blue Lake Grotto, the sizable cave is filled with water of astoundingly blue water. Estimated to be over 200 feet deep, the water morphs into a spectacularly beautiful blue when sunlight shines through the cracks in the ceiling of the cave and makes the water come alive. It's believed that the lake is fed by an underground river which has yet to be determined. The last major expedition into its magical water occurred in 1992 when a Franco-Brazilian expedition went diving and found a fantastic treasure. Thousands of prehistoric animal bones, giant mammals and more. The underwater archaeological site is rich in giant mammal fossils from saber-toothed tigers to the legendary giant sloths as big as elephants. Twin Town When you look at the number of twins born in this zip code, you'd be forgiven for thinking something must be in the water. In fact, some of the residents even say so. But of course, that's never been proven and probably never will. Instead, all we have is the mystery of Candido Godoy, a tiny agricultural town in southern Brazil. According to reports, the town is responsible for the most twin births on Earth. According to a university study, 10% of births between 1990 and 1994 were twins. That's more than five times the state average. That same study showed that 50% of those twins were identical. Clearly, something is going on in the area. In the absence of explanation, in typical fashion, there is myth and rumor. A more sinister explanation arose, stating, In this remote farming town where nearly 80% of residents are of German descent, shop fronts parade German names, and where an antiquated German dialect is still largely dominating to Brazil's official language, Portuguese. According to these myths, Josef Mengele, 
a Nazi scientist referred to as the Angel of Death, is the cause behind what locals call the Twin Revolution. The mad scientist Nazi was thought to have died near Sao Paulo in 1979, but first is said to have visited the region in the 60s, performing various obscure and mysterious tests on locals, specifically women who subsequently gave birth to twins. A former mayor has claimed that he went about his work under the alias Rudolf Wise. <laughs> Finger of God Dado de Deus is an awe-inspiring natural wonder located just 30 miles outside of the famed Rio de Janeiro. You can find a man-made and natural wonder all within 30 miles. How amazing is that? This natural granite artwork allures hikers, entices climbers, and amps up thrill-seekers from around the world. You can even climb its rocky peak. The nickname Finger of God is obvious from its appearance as a giant hand pointing the index finger towards the heavens. Standing at 5,417 feet, this is no easy climb, even for veterans. Those who dare are prepared for this ascent end up viewing a stunning view of the once capital of Brazil and surrounding national park. It's a favorite among both Brazilian and international climbers. This location is unique for climbers because rock formations like this exist in a few places around the globe, and even fewer safe enough for travel. The summit was originally claimed to be unreachable by elite European mountaineers in the 1800s, but in 1912, an all-Brazilian party paved the way for new adventurers to follow in their footsteps and make the ascent safely. The hypnotic focal point stands amongst a series of ridges and valleys. The granite rock formations are suspected of having formed over 620 million years ago. <laughs> San Paulo Blood Red Pool Somewhere in Sao Paulo, Brazil, there stands a towering 80-meter ship that appears to belong in a boat harbor rather than a residential neighborhood. Nevertheless, here we stand with this giant inverted arch building complete with porthole-shaped windows and blood-red pool. The peculiar Hotel Unique, as it's called, welcomes guests aboard their boat-shaped modernist fantasy with open arms. Known to the locals as the Watermelon, the strange crescent-shaped hotel is one of the lodging's main attractions and it greatly influences the shape of its rooms, as you might have imagined. The hotel's designer took full advantage of the oddly shaped walls by architecturally placing TV sets on the slant and extending tables to reach the edge of the curvature. Just as fascinating as the rooms in the rooftop terrace, which comes equipped with a gourmet restaurant and panoramic view of South America's largest city, Atop the terrace is the aforementioned blood red outdoor pool, complete with music that can be heard underwater. In the lobby, one can find a large blue circular cushion and a 15 tier stack of booze bottles. <laughs> the Man Anaconda A bizarre creature discovered by dam engineers in the Amazon rainforest has been classified as a type of Sicilian, a limbless amphibian that resembles an earthworm or, as many are quick to point out, part of the male anatomy. Yes, indeed, the so-called penis snake is as bizarre a creature as they come. The animal was revealed while workers were draining a portion of the Madeira River for maintenance on a highly controversial hydroelectric project. Six were discovered slithering along the rocky bottom. Little is known about the species, although it's thought to be aquatic and lacks lungs. They suspect it breathes through its skin instead. Other similar individuals have been discovered near the mouth of the Amazon, more than 1,550 miles away. Are they spreading? They're predators feeding on small fish, worms, and other aquatic invertebrates. They have poor eyesight and navigate primarily through smell. <laughs> Strange lights. Is it ball lightning? An alien? A soul returning from the afterlife? Your guess is as good as the experts. The strange phenomenon shows an orb of light of some sort descending from the sky and halting just above the ground, floating without bobbing. Then it scoots along the road with newfound motivation and disappears off screen. What in the world could these lights be? The CCTV footage is that of a business parking lot. The security guard who dropped the footage was stunned while he watched it. He had to play it back over and over just to make sure he wasn't going insane. With no reasonable explanation, he posted the feed and asked the world for help. It may be some sort of lens flare, but the precise movements give cause for concern. Epic Tunnel Heist Brazilian police this week foiled a criminal plot to rob a bank of $318 million by using an evil genius-styled secret tunnel. The team of 16 prospective robbers dug a tunnel 2,000 feet long that from a nearby rental house to Sao Paulo government-owned Banco de Brazil. 
The Sao Paulo State Public Safety Department reported the gang had been under surveillance for three months before the tunnel was revealed. The heist members allegedly spent $1.27 million constructing the tunnel, with the cost split among its participants and unknown investors. The alleged leader was a 35-year-old woman previously implicated in an attempted robbery of a security van in Paraguay a few months earlier. The robbers dug the tunnel by hand, loading the soil into sacks and carrying it through the tunnel to an underground stormwater drain. The impressive tunnel stood about three feet high and was reinforced with iron beams and wood at vital junctions. They even wired electricity through it. The walls were lined with plastic garbage bags to reduce the dust while they worked. The rented house above them was filled with food, water, special digging clothing, and tools. Police suspect the gang had the assistance of an engineer. <laughs> Gigantic Anacondas The giant anaconda is a powerful creature said to be the direct descendant to the legendary Titano Boa that once dominated these lands. Today, the anaconda makes up some of the world's largest snakes. These serpents of old can reach whopping lengths, some even around 30 feet long and weigh up to 600 pounds. Anyone looking to challenge one of those, even a human, sure has their work cut out for them. The anaconda, like the python, is a constrictor, meaning it uses constriction as its primary source of offense. With its massive size per square inch come tremendous power that most creatures on the planet couldn't resist. The anaconda latches onto its prey first with a bite and then coils and squeezes until it senses its prey is no longer living. There isn't a creature on the planet that isn't fair game for the green anaconda. If it wasn't for geolocation, many more species might fall prey to this monstrous beast. They indeed can hunt whatever they want. If they choose to do so, they could even subdue an elephant if it got around its neck. These nightmare-inducing snakes are known throughout ancient human history, stretching as far back as cave murals and ancient texts of divine snakes or hellish ones. There have been many stories, novels, and films dedicated to exploring the terror that is the anaconda, but those terrors are often over-exaggerated for the sake of imagination, not reality. This mysterious UFO sighting shows an oblong object flying through the Brazilian skies. No reports other than this one video. Could it be one of the first sightings? It sure moves strange. But it could also be the lead of pencil held by a string in front of the camera. These types of videos always draw concern for many reasons, but particularly their inability to capture smooth footage. Is this the cause of the alien ship distortion? Is the video handler horrible at holding the camera? Or is the whole thing a tactic to cover up the fact it's a hoax? There certainly isn't enough information in this one video to answer all those questions. <laughs> Peanut Street The residential street of Peanut Street, as it's known to locals, will always have ample parking. That's because as soon as you park your car there, you forget to apply the parking brake and it'll slowly begin to roll uphill, gaining speed even. There are lots of explanations, including that the hill is haunted or that a massive deposit of magnetic iron ore lies deep below the street, drawing vehicles up it with its powerful pull. But the truth is much less dramatic than that. In reality, the phenomenon is apparently an optical illusion reserved for a few locations around the globe. Though the street appears to be on a steep incline, there's actually a slight dip in the road. Because of the lines it forms in contrast with the surrounding scenery, it appears that you're going uphill when really, you're going downhill. That doesn't stop people from taking to social media to blast about the incredible illusion. <laughs> Giant Emerald A massive emerald rock was recently discovered and it's estimated to be worth 238 million euros. It was located in a gem mining field in Brazil and is currently under the watchful eye of heavy security. Locked away in a secret location, the owner, who can only be identified by his initials FG, fears kidnapping, extortion, and armed robbery. It was revealed that it would need a forklift to move the gym, where the risks of a heist are high in Brazil, where criminal gangs often utilize explosives to raid banks and carry powerful firearms. If they heard of a find like this one, there would be competition in the underworld to steal it. The owner says he's taking every precaution to ensure it's kept safe. Rio Negro one of the world's wetter natural wonders is a two-toned convergence of two massive Amazon streams. About six miles outside the city of Manaus is a place known as the Meeting of Waters. 
Here, the dark waters of the aptly named Rio Negro mix with the sandy Upper Amazon, otherwise known as the Rio Solimoas. Although the rivers meet, they don't mix. Instead, they snake in a race alongside each other for four miles, forming a polychromatic boundary so large it can be viewed from space. A geologist described the scale of the meeting of waters as six Mississippis. The coffee-like coloring of the rivers is due to various sediments, such as sand, mud, and silt. In contrast, the Negro carries very little sediment. Its dark tea-like color is primarily caused by dissolved plant matter. The two running side by side is like a fantastical world of art. It runs slower and is about 6 degrees Celsius warmer than the Solimoas, whose swifter, cooler, denser waters rebuff the smaller river's invitation, making it difficult for their flows to merge. When the two rivers come together to form the impressive Lower Amazon, there's a good distance left to travel. The aptly dubbed River Sea continues across the continent. It will encounter several more offshoots along its route to the Atlantic Ocean, but none match the wonder and majesty of the meeting of water sight. Snake Island Off the coast of Brazil, there is a stunning island with all the dreamlike qualities you might imagine from the tropics – tropical weather, rainforest, and a coastline to die for. It's too bad no one can ever go there thanks to a selfish creature who has taken over. You might think it's off-limits to maintain its beauty, but that would be the nice part of the story. The horror part of the tale comes to us in the form of biblical-style infestation. The island, known as Ilha de Camara Grande, is covered with thousands upon thousands of snakes. These aren't your typical non-venomous garter snakes either. These are the worst kind of snakes you can imagine. The ones with a bite so potent that you'll be calling it quits should you ever get nicked. Simply known as Snake Island, it has a plethora of interesting and scary facts behind it that it's hard to tell what's real and what's a myth. To be honest, for an island that's owned by the millions of snakes that roam there, most people would probably not even know to care about them. <coughs> Swimming Pool Collapse It might seem like a dream to live in a building with a pool on the roof, but it's for reasons like this that it isn't done as often as you might want. Thank goodness no one was swimming in this pool when it decided to go kaput. The uniformity of the failing pool is oddly entertaining and satisfying to watch. The owners should be glad that it didn't collapse into someone's apartment or something. There is still significant damage to personal property here, but just imagine if you had just pulled into your parking spot and you were ready to kick up the feet when something like this drops on you. Think of the amount of force that would have had on a human body if it was enough to pick up and move the cars parked there. The pool falls with such weight and ferocity that it lifts multiple vehicles from their parked positions before the water subsides. 270 residents were still forced to leave their homes for five days while crews repaired the extensive damage. Various teams of engineers, inspectors, and investigators were on the scene to investigate the cause. A team of engineers and inspectors have gathered some evidence as to the cause, but nothing has been released. Some of the tenants reported a strong smell of gas as the pool was heating up. Others claim they heard a loud noise before rushing water. Brazil is a crazy place for multiple reasons. From awesome cities to natural beauties reserved for the pages of fiction, you can't argue there are plenty of things to see in Brazil. An area so rich in natural and human history is bound to reveal some crazy secrets from time to time. If you enjoyed the video, smash that like button and don't forget to subscribe to get all our content delivered right to your inbox.